Hello, and welcome to the AlphaCamp 2019 R1 What's New videos. In this short video, we're going to be covering the functionality in a wonderful function known as Edit Order Operations by Tool. This is an enhancement that we took inspiration from one of our previous products in which a user can define the exact sequence of the tools that he or she wants to follow and with a simple click of a button completely reassign the sequence of any job that has been presented to the user. This is of critical importance in environments where we have multiple pieces like, uh, for example, a tombstone array, a tombstone configuration, or when we have nesting and we have hundreds, if not potentially uh, thousands of operations that we may want to reassign the sequence to. You'll be able to control, like it says here, by tool name, number, offset, or any combination of those parameters. So let's look at the functionality. If we take a look at this project, you'll see that this is a complex project. It has up to 36 individual operations, and the tools create an environment where if I was to completely reassign the sequence, it could take, it could take quite a bit of time. So what we have accomplished here is we are giving you an interface by which you can quickly import from the drawing all of the different tools in use. Or you can call an existing order that you saved in the past. And of course, you can save this particular order. Since I don't have an order saved right now, I'm going to import from the drawing. And you can see this is the exact sequence in which the, um, these operations are going to be carried out by the machine. So one of the things that I could do, for example, is define that I want to do all my drilling before I do any of my cutting. And then, of course, within this, I can go ahead and do further adjustments of the sequence. I could, for example, group all the different tools by diameter. Once I've done what I want over here, once I've set the sequence in the exact order in which I want it, I can save it. And then I can move on to selecting what type of comparisons I would like to deploy this time. I'm going to be comparing only the tool number, but I could compare the tool name, the number, or a combination of the offset, the number, and any of these. Since I want to compare the tool number, which is the exclusive identifier here, I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Do please notice on the left-hand side how the sequence now reassigns itself based on this. If we take a quick scan, you'll be able to see that the tools now follow the uh, order that I requested. Six, one, two, three. And that's exactly what we see here. 6, 1101, 1102, 1103. So this functionality is invaluable for um, people that are working with complex projects and they need to reassign the sequence of the tools. Or even if you have a complex nest and you just want to completely sweep the entire order. Thank you.